Hey guys, welcome back to JB Hot Wheels. Today we are reviewing Elite Series 135. Brock Lesnar. Back, you could collect these people. I'm not gonna say it. I don't really care about them. The full Brock Lesnar is pretty cool. He's a he's a power power house. He's F five German suplex signature moves. That's his signature moves. Brock Lesnar. WWE logo on the top. Brock Lesnar, Mattel on bottom. Figure looks cool. Uh, he got that uh, tattoo of a Venus. Now, why don't we say we crack this open? Plus, this is six plus. Pick this up at Walmart. We weren't initially going to until I saw this figure. This is one of the coolest basics I've ever seen. I heard that there's a new one coming out. I'm not sure if I'll be getting that one. Maybe that one for the uh, new articulation, but. Use Brock Lesnar. Keep on wanting to say Braun Breaker. But, uh. But, head sculpt's cool. Body's cool. You can still get that penis tattoo on him. The back tattoo's cool. Like it. He's wearing shorts. That has his logo on it. Glove says Lesnar. Lesnar. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. His PS black shoes. He has a ponytail. If you don't know, he did not have a ponytail back then. Once again, you can take off his head. The head sculpt's pretty cool. Is it smaller or bigger than an elite head? Let's take the elite head of Braun Breaker. Oh, same size. The details are not as good as uh, the details on the elite. But this is so far one of the coolest basics. Now, if you have a young Brock Lesnar and you want to use a more updated... Uh, a tire, you can use this, cause why not? Why not to do some mix and matches? This figure is very cool. It's an easy ten out of ten. My brother's gonna review the AJ Styles Elite. We already have the basic right here. He's gonna use that to compare. And uh, this video was recorded after he revealed the Elite. So here's the Elite. But the video will come out after the Elite video. I mean, before. Yes, tattoo on the side. Yep. Honestly, this is like my favorite basic. I think it's top number one. Tomorrow, stay tuned for our Ghost Face Mask collection, as we'll also be posting that. And maybe a couple other stuff. We're not sure. As for the rest of October, it will be Halloween theme. Hopefully. Now we're going to compare him to some elites. Here's him compared to Braun Breaker. These two are beast. Here's him compared to Roman Reigns. Ooh, they look good together. You saw that SummerSlam match last year. That was, that was one of the best matches they ever had. It's kind of like how a 
Cody Rhodes and Brock Lesnar had like a trilogy of matches. It just reminds me of that. He's, he's Sami Zayn. Now it's gone to articulation. Like any other basics, he has limited articulation. Let me show you the articulation. So you get moved the uh, legs up and down, both up and down. You can swivel the toes. You get uh, spread this arm out, uh, 360. Hand, 360. Elbow, 360. Same with this. I don't want to do it with this. Torso can move all the way. I don't really want to do it because it'll get loose. Same as the head. I don't want to get loose. You can pop the head off. You can do that. You can do this. You can do anything. You get bend it. <coughs> Stiff. Bend the hands. Bend the elbows. You get elite joints. Double jointed. Double jointed. Double jointed. Double jointed. Get a swivel, head, torso. But we're not mainly focused on Braun Breaker today. Maybe one, maybe another time. Because, you know, we already filmed a Braun Breaker review video. Honestly, I give this figure um, 10 out of 10. It's a huge buy. I love basics. I love elites. To me, I think they should get equal amount of love. Let me fix something. No, no, no. These basic is very cool. I'll say about 10 years ago, they came out with the, the, the first Brock Lesnar basic. And I could just tell, say, Mattel is doing a lot on improving their figures. I can tell that they're improving the basics even more with their new articulation. I'll be picking up that Brock Lesnar, but I don't want to do it anytime soon. Honestly, I wasn't initially going to get this figure, but I just saw at Walmart, we were literally going to shop for more ghost face masks, but... We already got enough at uh, Spirit Halloween. You see in tomorrow's video. But I could just say, cool head sculpt, cool everything, cool tattoos. One more comparison. Isn't compared to our custom Agent Stone figure factories from the side the Hedgehog films. I know it's a weird comparison, but we ha we didn't do a review on this. I have to go back to my camera roll. Maybe I can show it to you guys right now. I can't, you know, put on the volume of the video because of uh, copyright. But you see, we're unboxing the figure. We also made Dr. Eggman one from the Sonic movie. I mean, Robotnik, it depends. They're, they're like in very good conditions when we first bought them. Now they're like... Agent Stone's like a... His colors are not that good as before, same as Robotnik, but they're still pretty cool figures. Sorry if I got a little off topic, but this figure's very cool. If you want to see more uh, videos like this than just WWE News, you could do that. Plus, we would like to announce that we're not discontinuing the news because they're fake. But we're doing real ones. Ignore the ones back then. Most of them are fake. I think we just might move on to uh, other stuff. It We really don't know the future of JB Hot Wheels. All what we know is we should make more videos without images. I know, maybe that's just an idea. Like, maybe make more reviews, videos about us in our ghost face costumes. think that's something we should have done last year. But last year, we weren't really 
on this channel that much. We want to make this channel feel fun again. I think doing this mixed up with the real news will make this channel even funner. I do want to say shout out to uh, Brock Lesnar for having this great figure. And uh, who knows? Maybe some point down the line, him and Jim Carrey will get in some altercations. I think I'm living in the chat GPT world. <laughs>